Hello, I'm Anamika Jain and I'm working as PGD Physics in DAB Public School, Shishta Vihar, Delhi. Today, I'm going to demonstrate a very simple method of representing the Fleming's left hand rule. For this rule, you will just need a battery eliminator kept at 4 volts some connecting wires, a small cardboard and an aluminium foil with a ring magnet which you can easily obtain from a speaker and it is kept under the aluminium foil. Here in this battery eliminator we are putting our voltage at 4 volts with this as a positive terminal and this as a negative terminal of the battery. Now you will find that the direction of the current is given in this way and I am holding the north pole of the magnet on this side. So accordingly the direction of the magnetic field is upward and the current direction is in this direction. Now that means according to the Fleming left hand rule the force should be in the outward direction. So when I switch on the battery you will find that the deflection which we are getting is on the same side as is provided by the Fleming left hand rule. Let us show it once again. You will see that the deflection of the foil is on the outer side. So I am repeating, when the direction of the current is going in this direction and the magnet magnetic field is in the upward direction, the deflection according to the Fleming left hand rule should be given which is given by the thumb, it should be in the outer direction. So the foil is behaving accordingly. Now let us reverse the direction of the magnet. I am reversing the direction of the magnet. Now the deflection should be on the opposite side. That means previously if the direction of the foil was on this side, now the force should be exerted on the opposite side. Let us see how. You can see that the foil gets deflected in this particular direction. I am showing it again. You can observe that the foil has been deflected in the other direction. So that means the Fleming left hand rule can be easily shown with this simple setup. Nowadays the Fleming left hand rule can also be observed in the form of the right hand palm rule. According to right hand palm rule the four fingers gives a direction of the magnetic field whereas the thumb gives a direction of the current. So if the thumb is going giving me the direction of the current The thumb is giving the direction of the current and the magnetic field is given by the four fingers of the right hand. Then the direction of the push, the direction of the push of the hand, right hand is giving me the direction of the force. So I am again showing it, thumb is giving me the direction of the current, the four fingers are giving me the direction of the magnetic field and now the push will be on this side. So therefore, the aluminum foil should get deflected in the outer side. So you can see that the push on the aluminum foil is on the outer side. So we conclude that the Fleming left hand rule or the right hand palm rule can be demonstrated by this simple setup. 